Well, the great thing about being incoming chamber president, which has to do with you know, businesses within the community, but also being the education council chairman, is that education council is about figuring out pathways for students so that they can all be successful regardless if they're high achievers or persons that may be more inclined to have TVET, but everybody can be successful. Regardless which pathway you take, you always need persons to be there to guide you, to you know, get you on the right tracks and or to tell you that you may you know, have some pitfalls that you're about to encounter. And the great thing about mentoring Cayman is that you're able to match persons who have been successful with students across the spectrum. But you know, for Chamber, now these are some of our high flyers to also help them to not only achieve, but to go even further to become the leaders of tomorrow. And the one thing I look to do probably in the future is to see how we can also integrate some of those other students that may not be those high flyers at this point in time to get them under one umbrella to make sure everybody has the same level of success in the future. This mentoring program aligns with the minister's current agenda in the fact that the minister himself, the Honorable Bernard Bush, has said that he wants to put a program in place for talent identification. That means that we're going to be working with all of the stakeholders, education, culture, the different private sector companies to identify talented youngsters, which is part of what this Cayman Mentoring Program is all about. With the Mentoring Cayman Program for about four years now, and I must say it has been such a rewarding experience. It really is a wonderful initiative to be a part of. You know, I've had mentors throughout my life and still to this day, they are a huge and significant part of my life and I am who I am. I'm where I am because of them. And so when the opportunity was given and, and the invitation was given to be a part of this program some four years ago, I did not hesitate because I just knew that this would be an excellent channel to give back not only to my community, but to make a difference in someone's life. And I, it has proven time and time again how important and significant this program is. And I'm looking forward to just building those relationships again and just seeing, you know, how much that they have improved throughout the program. And at the end, you know, having my mentees to share with me how much this program has made a difference, that's what I'm looking forward to the most. We do believe in this program. I think that the Mentoring Cayman program is such an important program to kind of uh, set the path for so many young people on this island. I really think that if they can complement their academic studies with a more professional type of information and coaching with people that have been really in the business life, in, in, in the professional life, uh, it just can be a success for these kids. So I think it's a huge opportunity for the future Caymanian leaders. And Cayman Water has that responsibility as well, to support programs that really uh, look into the future of the country. And that's basically why we are doing this. We are future forward-looking company, so we want to support forward-looking programs. And mentoring is definitely that. I'm grateful for Chamber of Commerce for selecting me to be part of this mentoring program and I am grateful for being paired with a legal counsel which would be my career path and I'm looking forward to spending more time with my mentor and learning their path of work.